Today on Free Field Training, we are looking at the Proper Summerweight Tactical Shorts. Proper sent me these shorts for review about two months ago, and I've been wearing them ever since. I'm going to give these the highest recommendation I possibly can. I'm buying a couple more pairs for next summer. So these are the shorts. I know I'm not a really great underwear model or anything, but the shorts are really nice and I really like them. So I'm going to go through some of the pockets and features that I use on the shorts and some things that you might be interested in using if you buy them. So these shorts have kind of an elastic waistband that has belt loops. The belt loops are large enough where I can fit an inch and three quarter belt through them. And the elastic waistband means that when I'm carrying, it's real easy. The elastic pops in and out a little bit, gives me a little more breathing room, especially if you're sitting in the car and you've got, you're carrying something appendix, it stretches a little bit and allows you to be a little more comfortable while sitting in the car. Belt loops are about an inch and three quarter, which means you can fit most EDC type belts in there. The pockets, the little slash pockets, the normal ones that people have on jeans or tactical pants are reinforced here on the edges, which is cool, especially given the material these are made out of. This is a really lightweight material they actually list it as being like UPF 30, so it protects you against the sun really well, even though it's a very, very light material and it dries very quickly when you use them. I actually wear these shorts when I would normally be stuck just kind of wearing basketball shorts because it's so hot out. But the little reinforcements on the edge of each pocket means I can clip my phone on one side and a knife on the other side and not have any wear marks on there from clipping the knife in and out that I get so often with blue jeans. The pockets are really deep. These main slash pockets, and even though it's a really lightweight material, it doesn't make it uncomfortable to carry the stuff I normally carry in my pocket. So I've got my lighter here and my car keys on one side. And on the other side, on this little Velcroed pocket, I can fit my flashlight. It's a pretty large flashlight. This is the WowTech BSS V3. And I can fit that right here on the inner pocket that's Velcroed. And this one's already, this one's also pretty deep. There's two sets of cargo pockets on the bottom of the shorts. The outer one, the ones that I like most, are Velcro and big enough to fit my wallet in without it bulging too much. And there's a zipper pocket behind it, so if you're going on a roller coaster or something and you want to be able to put something in there where it's not definitely not going to fall out and come loose, you get a zipper pocket and that's on both sides. There's also a pocket all the way in the small of your back that you could use to keep money or your passport if you're on vacation or you could put a handcuff key in which is normally what I do with it so I always have a handcuff key with me no matter what. They come in an 11 inch inseam because I'm so short I actually had these hemmed down a little bit. I took a couple inches off of them so for normal size people they're going to come in the right length the 11 inch length that most people like. So that's the proper summer weight tactical shorts. If you want shorts either for on or off duty when it's really, really hot out. They come in a variety of colors, both uniform and non-uniform colors that you might be interested in. So there's a link for them down in the description if you're interested. Until next week, you guys be safe. Take care of each other. Hey, thanks for watching Free Field Training on YouTube. While you're here, why don't you go check out one of our other videos, or you can head on over to the Patreon and see how you can get your name put on the videos like these fine folks listed over here. There's also some exclusive content on Patreon that just shows you kind of behind the scenes like you're seeing now. We'll see you guys next time.